hello guys and welcome back so now from this video onwards we will start working on our doors and lock system right lock and unlock so let's start from this first door right here all right first of all what we're gonna do is we're gonna animate our door so in order to do that make sure that you select the door click on this animation window if you don't have this animation window click on window at the top then go inside animation and in here you will find the animation window or as you can see you can press control plus six to open this up all right then select the door click on create and you can select anywhere you want to create this so in the game I'm gonna create a new folder right here all right I'm gonna name this as door animations or just anymore right then I'm gonna select that folder all right or actually double click on it and let's name this animation as idle all right click save here is the idle animation now we can record it so uh, what we're gonna do in order to record it I'm gonna make this as all right right here on the right side I'm gonna make the position Z of this as uh, 58 from 57 all right then I'm gonna click on record and when I click on record I'm gonna get back right there remove at and put 7 all right then stop recording so this will be our idle all right now we need to make a door open animation so in order to do that click on this idle right here it will show you this create new clip so click on that and name this as door open all right it's in the same game folder and then inside the door anim folder click save now we have the door open right here let's click on record all right and first of all we are gonna change this from 58 to 57 all right as you can see it is recorded now we can move 15 uh, uh, seconds forward all right while the recording is start and the door is right there now what we're gonna do we're gonna rotate the door like this a little bit all right then move the door right here and a little bit right there all right then move 15 second forward to uh, 0 0.3 and right here I'm gonna rotate it even more all right and I'm gonna whoops okay select it again I'm gonna move it right here and a little bit forward all right then I'm gonna move it to 45 and then I'm gonna open it up a little bit more and move it right here and then a little bit forward that is it all right now if we stop the recording and get back right here as you can see this will be our door open animation in this way you can create your own door animation I know this doesn't look perfect but you can make it even more perfect all right but I'm gonna just leave this as it is uh, since it looks perfectly fine to me all right we have the idle and the door open now if you keep select the door as you can see it has created an animator component right here and in the controller it also has this exact door controller so if you double click on it it will open this up as you can see right here so what you can do you can create a trigger right here by the name of open then make a transition from idle to door open select that transition and right here just add open and remove that as exact time all right so now whenever we trigger it it will open up the door like this as you can see all right make sure to set up the animator for it in the same way so we have animated the door all right and we have the controller and its animation right in here in the door anim folder now in the next video what we're gonna do is we're gonna work on the door open script all right in which uh, if the player has a key then in that case we will allow the player to open this door and if the player doesn't have any key then we will not open this door right so with this done let's end this video right here